All right, folks, for immediate release, let's take a look. All right, this is going to be available December 20 of 21. Um, I did a video on this probably six months ago, right? We knew this was kind of coming out, but we didn't really know when. All right, so obviously with the great success of the Milwaukee Packout, DeWalt, Tough System 1 and 2.0, I'll even go as far as the rigid. Definitely. Because the best value box is out there. And we know Makita and Bosch also have a nice array of boxes, right? The L box with Bosch. Um, so it was just a matter of time before rigid got into the mobile. Um, storage platform okay obviously we got a rolling box a medium box and a small box to start with there's probably going to be many more to come um we'll take a look at the pictures there's also um a lot of organizational products coming out as you can see here again i did a video on this not too long ago all right, let's just go and look at the prices. All right, so the rolling toolbox here, okay, is going to be $84, okay? Uh, designed with impact-resistant material to handle the toughest of situations. And I can't even see. And features a common locking surface to connect with the Ryobi Link Okay, so they're calling this the Ryobi Link Rolling Toolbox. They definitely got a funky little lid or design on this box here. The wheels look very, very solid. Um, and I like the two handles on the side as well. Not uncommon, but... So I wish they would, well, with the rolling box, yeah. Really doesn't make too much sense to put one on top. Um, the wide telescoping steel handle and 9-inch all-terrain wheels. So we're talking bigger than really anyone out there, right? The Milwaukee, I believe, is 8 inches. The Tough System 2.0 is 7 inches. Uh, Rigid coming in, I mean, Ryobi coming in at 9 inches. Okay, 9-inch all-terrain wheels that support a 200-pound load capacity. For ease of transport, the handle can be removed as well, just like the DeWalt, allowing the link rolling toolbox to be easily stored in a truck bed beneath a cover or in the work van. The integrated Ryobi accessory bit storage are included. We'll take a look at that. Wide steel telescoping handle, large 9-inch all-terrain wheels, impact-resistant material, IP65 rated, 200-pound load capacity, durable latches, integrated, integrated Ryobi accessory bit storage, integrated tie-down anchors. I'm, I'm pretty impressed here. Ryobi's playing hardball. $84, too. Secure locking point includes a rolling toolbox, double organizational bin, seamlessly connect mobile and stationary storage needs proudly made in the USA with global materials, limited lifetime warranty. All right, so this box is not made in Israel like um, a lot of the TTI boxes, rigid, Milwaukee. I think the early Tough System boxes uh, 1.0 was also made in Israel at one time, but all right, so $84. For the rolling toolbox, here is your large box. All right, the Ryobi Link Medium Toolbox. This is going to come in at 54 bucks. Okay, designed to handle the toughest solutions. I'm not going to go too nuts and just repeat the same stuff. IP65 rated. All right, impact resistant material, 80 pound load capacity. IP65 water and dust resistant. Uh, dust resistant and in big bold letters front release button all right so 
Yeah, it looks like it's under the handle. So, kind of made like Milwaukee a little bit, I have to say. Uh, durable latches, integrated Ryobi accessory bit storage. So, you know, they want it's IP65 rated. They kind of made it to slide into the back of a truck uh, or the work van. You know, this is they're, they're gearing us towards the pro. All right, now obviously they have it in the garage. Uh, here is the Ryobi Link Standard Toolbox. They're not calling this a small box or an org organizer. Okay, obviously it doesn't have a clear lid, but you could have it, you know, still be an organizer. But you would want to see what's in it. But anyway, they're calling this the Standard Toolbox. Impact resistant, 50 pound load capacity, IP65 resistant front release button, durable latches, proudly made in the U.S. All right, also, you're going to have a crate 34 97 So you guys remember, right, the rigid for 14 bucks. I believe it's now 19 99 I have to say, um, I was pretty impressed with the pricing here. Um, I mean, $44, you're looking at really Milwaukee prices. Uh, this this is actually a pretty good price, but again, it, it, not as big. I don't think it's a 22 inch box. We'll have to see, but definitely not as big as Milwaukee's medium box. And the rolling toolbox at eighty four dollars, you know, with those nice big wheels, um, nice handle. I mean, not too bad. But I have to say, this crate is a little. A little expensive and it doesn't look that big okay um 34.97 50 pound capacity when stacked on the ryobi link mobile storage uh system or platform 25 load capacity when hung on the ryobi link wall rails sold separately all right we're going to talk about them too all right so Again, includes a tool crate, proudly made in the USA, easily moved from mobile to wall with integrated handles. All right, so here you see kind of a little system put up in a garage where they got the baseball helmets, the gloves. You know, you got a cone for some reason up there. Um, you got a radio, it looks like some bats, uh, some sports equipment, tennis racket. All right, right out of the back of uh suv here then you got um you know a blower the fan on this other side here with our favorite mounting um bracket right where you can hang your tools right the drill the impact angle grinders we've talked about that we've done a couple of videos i don't know if this one is different it looks different because it's all green we'll have to see all right, so this is great, guys. You know, I, I, I think I would not be surprised if we see the other companies start to kind of go towards this. Now, they all have their own systems, right, that are, you know, obviously geared for the professional, the tradesman, right? But don't be surprised because this is a really good option that you can kind of do both ways. All right, you could hang this in the trailer, right? All it is is hooks. So, I mean, the profit margins must be amazing. Now, with this one, you're going to get four hooks. It looks like um, you're going to get two 33-inch wall rails that are easily installed with visible mounting points to provide maximum stud engagement to hold 75 pounds per linear foot weight, okay? So, easy installation with the included hardware. So, it comes with the screws and everything, which is good. Customizable to optimize your space. Wall rail, 75 pounds per linear foot. Weight capacity. Wall rails are made with high strength polymer material. 33 inch rail length for maximum stud engagement. Okay, limited lifetime warranty. Now we're going to look at the shelf. Okay, so we know 
about the other two wall cabinets, right? Obviously, one has a lockable compartment, right? And then the other one, which, you know, it's only $5 more, I think, for the lockable um, little cabinet or compartment, right? Well, this one uh, is called the Ryobi Link Tool Organizer Shelf. All right, really coming in kind of at the same price. All right, I personally like the other ones a little bit better, but again, this one I can definitely see. You know, it's you know you got all the side, um, like for screwdrivers, hammers, whatever you want to put in there that you really don't have with the other one. Um, I don't know if this is. Let's take a look. It is steel construction. So steel construction, four side, four slots to organize a variety of power tools, right? So obviously the the drill driver, the hammer drill, impact, um, you know, angle grinder, multi tool, okay. Uh, Fifty pound weight capacity. Own your own space with Ryobi Link modular storage system. Okay, wide shelf surface for optimal storage onboard hand tool stores so like i said you know screwdrivers uh you know uh what else could you probably get you could probably maybe get a you know uh i mean i guess you could put probably you know some wrenches in there i wish they had one with tools in it so you can actually see and here's another one in ha a hanging shelf but you know Obviously, whatever fits in these little pre-cut um, slots. All right. Obviously, you got a lot for screwdrivers, it looks like. But they're very close together. So, I don't know how the handles are going to... It really looks like you got three for the screwdriver. I don't know what you can kind of get in there. but And here's the hanging shelf. Okay. Also, steel construction. You get the additional J-hook storage for smaller items. Designed to maximize your storage space, the wide shelf, and surface. And this is $50, by the way. Surface and six J-hooks allow for maximum organization in tight spaces. The steel construction allows a 50-pound weight capacity. Again, own your own space. Steel construction, additional J-hook storage for smaller items. All right, wide shelf surface for optimal storage space, 50-pound weight capacity. All right, you can also buy separately. Here's a two-pack of the wall rails. You can get this for 30 bucks. All right, now you're probably going to have to use Ryobi's hooks, okay? Um, yeah, here's your standard hook set. But 30 bucks if you kind of want to... I don't know why you would buy this over it coming with everything already, right? Because this way it's thirty bucks. Well, yeah, twelve ninety eight. This has a, this is the Ryobi Link standard hook set, twelve ninety eight, fifty pound weight capacity, non slip coating to securely hang items. Limited lifetime warranty, durable steel construction. Ideal for levels, tape rolls, and hand tools. I like it, man. I, I, this is, I think, going to be very popular. Here's your multi-purpose hook. And I usually get mine at Walmart. Uh, but this is the multi-purpose hook. An ideal fit for ladders and recreational equipment. 50-pound weight capacity. Steel construction. Ideal for ladders and recreational equipment. Like I said, non-slip coating to securely hang items. And here is a screwdriver holder for 12 bucks. All right. You know, and what's good about this is you can kind of put this around, you know, maybe your uh, workbench. So, you know, obviously you always see the Wera little plastic screwdriver holder there. But a lot of them don't come with something like that. So, you know, you can keep this, you know, they got items that are kind of worth for your work area, your workbench, or if you kind of work on like a tool cart, 
And then they got obviously, you know, stuff for recreational items and and ladders and stuff like that. And then you got your smaller stuff. So they really hit everything here. All right, 25 pound weight capacity. That's more than enough for screwdrivers. Here's a large power tool hook. All right, for 12 bucks. 50 pound weight capacity, ideal for large power tools and lawn and garden equipment. All right, so this is kind of for, you know, your weed whacker, your blower, maybe some bigger power tools. Here's a double hook. Okay. So here, these are going to be coming December. We'll talk more about these, but um, these will be available December of 2021. So within the next month. Um, yeah, I think it's a good start. Um, you know, I don't know how many people are going to be into the wall storage type stuff, but again, I, I don't see why you wouldn't, you know, it's all about optimal. I mean, garage space guys, we all have them right. Garage as well. Not everybody, but most of you do. And a lot of them, at least a lot of my buddies, their garages are just a mess. And if you've seen mine, it's probably the worst you've ever seen. So to have organization for really not breaking the bank, all right? I mean, you know, Father's Day, maybe the wife can kind of get this. You know, this is 50 bucks. I mean, not super cheap, but guys, remember, we're probably going to see deals on this, all right? But anyway, the main thing is the new Ryobi Link, um, you know, portable mobile um platform here all right they look really well made guys um some items are a little bit more pricey than i expected but overall i mean again i think the milwaukee's five dollars more uh, i think it's 39 bucks unless they went up to 44 bucks i don't know but um Everything else is, is 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 pretty solid. All right, um, metal latches, which is nice. Again, you got the nine-inch all-terrain wheels on the rolling toolbox. We'll have to see, guys. Hopefully, this will. Well, I know I hundred percent know this will be in the store at some point. Don't be surprised if it's available online first. Again, this is kind of the stuff they want to kind of sell in store to a degree, only because of probably shipping costs, um, or maybe just a rolling box, really. This really isn't too bad, this stuff here. But um, don't be surprised if we see it available online first, and then maybe in 2022, they start hitting the store. But maybe we'll see them come December 1st. Who knows? Again, I'm sure they want to sell... You know, this is the holiday season, the most popular and most important selling season for these companies. So uh, don't be, we, we, we might see them in the store. We'll have to see. But anyway, for the people that have been waiting, the new Ryobi um, X-Link system or link system, we'll call it. <clears throat> Coming soon to a Home Depot near you. Ryobi Link. Portable, mobile, and garage storage.